What is up everyone? Welcome back to the channel, Children's Playground. This is Children. And it's going to be an exciting day today. Uh, we have already received the much-awaited um, rewards that we were waiting for. And uh, let's just go over to the inbox. So, um, I, I'd like to share to you just a few moments here where I'll be opening up the rewards that I uh, received. And of course, uh, this video is all about um, opening our 6-star premium character and the 6-star um, selector character. And um, right now, uh, we're just gonna go over to the uh, option that uh, or the selectors that uh, we're gonna be having. But before that, um, there's a special <laughs> event or a special occasion uh, today because we have um, our very first subscriber for this channel and her name is Star. Uh, it might be a her, but uh, it might be a he. So I hope you can let me know. Uh, first subscriber is Starlight and I did receive a reply that uh, there's some suggestions here. Um, among the suggestions, I am yielding toward Mantis, uh, and as I promised, I will be using Mantis for my 6-star selector later. Um, also, uh, there was also a strong suggestion for Sharon Carter, but uh, since Sharon Carter is farmable, I'm gonna um, do some grinding for Sharon Carter as well. Definitely gonna consider um, the first subscribers um, comments and since Starlight is the first subscriber uh, it's gonna be uh, a special and uh, the treatment for Starlight is gonna be <laughs> very special uh, within the duration of all our upcoming videos okay so let's start actually um, let's see here but let me launch the future fight for my veteran account so we're back again here with our pre-to-play account uh, we just reached level 33 and so far the rosters that i have um are pretty nice uh, they're uh, good getting there and i'm trying to balance out the um, current experience uh, for all the missions that i've been trying to get and uh, trying to get uh, Sharon Carter to reach level 60 as well uh, Sorry, not Sharon Carter, but <laughs> Sharon Rogers I'm getting confused with this too, but uh, Anyway, um, so Sharon Car Sharon Rogers, uh, we're trying to get to sit level 60 to get it more competitive in timeline battle and of course the other game modes um, Shuri is more much more uh, of a support So I tried to do some testing with her. She's really nice and got a uh, wonderful DPS, but uh, I think her role would be definitely be support. Now, uh, Loki is still there, and uh, the very thing that I need to do with Loki upon my first testing is to at least upgrade his uh, damage output. And also, very, very important, if you are a new Loki player, we need to be upgrading the uh, this one, this, the skill the fifth skill uh, in order to have her summon have a little more uh, input there so yeah and also the energy barrier um right now the energy barrier only lasts for a very few seconds so it's always good to max out on the energy barrier in order to get the maximum uh, number of hits or the uh, number of seconds that the shield will be appearing so just a little tip for our uh, Loki users um, so for this the status of our uh, free-to-play account and let me just share some moments here where I'll be claiming the gifts let's start off with the legendary battle box uh, these are all just legendary rewards so these are all good. Uh, gold is always welcome. And some gear up kits because uh, we're in the early stage. We, we could really use some gear up kits. Absorbing ISO 8. That's nice. Oh! 
Wow, wow. We just received an extreme obelisk from uh, a chest. So max HP is really nice. Uh, later on, when we are focusing with our PvP um, characters, and critical damage is always welcome. We might, we might need to reroll this uh, because of energy attacks. I'm not really a very fan of this um, last skill. Okay, that's nice. Extreme Obelisk, our very first, um, we call this Mythic, um, Extreme Obelisk. So that's nice. Um, sharing with you this premium chest that I've been getting. Let's see if we get a good character here. Wow! Oh my gosh! It's Agent Venom! I didn't know you can get a premium character from this... Wow! Oh my... It, he's... Oh! <laughs> wow! Hello there! Hello there, Agent Venom! Oh my gosh! I was actually planning to use... um. Uh, or trying to find a way how to get the premium bios for Agent Venom. So <laughs> that was a really awesome pool. I cannot believe I got an Agent Venom. Let's see what we got on this next one. And it's a 5 star Agent Venom. Okay, Gamora. Probably the worst character in the game. I don't really like Gamora, but let's see. I'm hoping to have or. I'm hoping that uh, she'll receive a good uniform somehow, especially with Guardians of the Galaxy just came and ca coming out. So let's see. Uh, but I'm definitely not too happy with Gamora. But I did get, receive a wonderful six, sorry, five star Venom. So I just need to find a way to um, get him to six stars. That's not too hard, to be honest, guys. But uh, all you need to do is to wait for a. Uh, six star rank up ticket so i don't need uh, any any hard work now and i think he is usable in five star because he has some really nice kit uh, on his end and an iframe on the fifth skill so that's a very very good pull for us so let's get let's get over the uh let's get let's go to the rest of the main event for this video by the way let's claim this first there's a free comic book day gift also given out to us for this ant-man and the wasp okay not bad uh it's a legendary card so it can help us the card itself is not really impressive but uh we can use this as a shortcut for re-rolling a mythic card so that's not really not really bad. You cannot really complain for free stuffs like this. And um, yeah, so let's claim this uh, rank. Oh, let's call this clear ticket. Thank you very much. Okay, so let's go back here. Um, there is some check-in reward. Okay, let me just clean up this timeline rewards. So very important. If you are a free to play player, maximize the number of timeline or timeline status that you have because um, timeline is really very good mode later on when we focus on the video um, I will be giving you sa a video on what game modes to focus on and how you can better let game modes help you out on um, developing your characters okay I'm just trying to clean up this one Take a look at this. Timeline is one of the um, rare game modes where you can get a crystal. So crystal is a, a pretty scarce resource in the game. But uh, if you do well in timeline battle, then you'll be getting a 6 stars. Uh, sorry, not 6 stars, but uh, crystals. Um, contribution reward, all this. Really nice things here. Okay, so I think we clean up as much as possible. Right. So, our inbox is clean. I still can't believe I got a Agent Venom 6 star. Sorry, 5 star Agent Venom from the premium chest. 
that is just so nice anyway um so here uh we're just gonna claim our six star character as promised uh, again thank you starlight for being our first subscriber and uh, as promised i will be claiming mantis where are you girl mantis came out there she is so i'm gonna claim mantis uh thank you for your suggestion starlight and i will work on the uh other heroes that you mentioned robbie reyes might be the, our next six star character uh, on the next upcoming six star selector and of course we will be uh, grinding for sharon carter okay let's see here so welcome to the family mantis all right so let me just share to you the six star premium character so this is the first time I'm doing this. Uh, let me take a screenshot actually. Let's take a screenshot of that uh, selector. So in the selector, uh, we have Spider-Man 2099, we have Luna Snow, we have Carnage, Agent Venom, Ironheart, Kid Kaiju, Enchantress, Killmonger, and Gwenpool. So these are all very good characters, uh, with the exception of a few characters that are um, not really impactful that much in the game, like Ironheart, Kid Kaiju, and Gwenpool. Um, they seem to have lost, lost their shine uh, with all these new characters coming in, and Carnage has lost his throne. Carnage used to be the very um, top in combat villain and un until um, Apocalypse came in uh, and all the other free to play combat villain like um, Sandman and Titania uh, th these uh, characters are now being used more in Alliance Battle Extreme and provided that Carnage is a paywall it's it's really hard for uh, uh, new players to be able to get him but for our case we're just gonna try to um, see a thought process who's gonna be selected for this six star uh, premium character um, my first pick is uh, I'm torn between three characters of course uh, Actually, there were four. Uh, so, Spider-Man 2099, Luna Snow, Luna Snow, uh, Agent Venom is also what I'm trying to consider, and also Enchantress. So, those four uh, is um, my choice. I have played a lot with Enchantress before, especially when I was starting my, uh, my veteran account. And she is just awesome. She can she helped me a lot in World Boss, especially Thanos, because her charm effect has a very unique effect and it still charms the boss. Really impressed with the, the way she worked for me. Um, Agent Venom, of course. No one can complain with Agent Venom. Uh, he used to be the king of combat. Alliance Battle Extreme and of course he has a decent kit um, when he came out uh, back then he was really the guy uh, for combat uh, but quickly got outshined by other characters Luna Snow has been the prime uh, probably the reigning speed character for ABX and um, in terms of world boss she is also very very good um even at tier one uh she really shines and uh, her kit is really good you don't really need to tier to her um that early so you can really maximize her stay at tier one but right now my choice for this six star premium character would definitely be um spider-man 2099 
I would go for Luna Snow. Uh, but then I need to develop Misty Knight as her um, leader. And we have Shuri to back up and produce additional damage when she goes to Alliance Battle Extreme. So having her in Alliance Battle Extreme definitely requires me to have uh, Misty Knight as her companion. And I can only do that by setting aside one of the premium or not premium but uh, setting aside one of the six star selector character so i don't really feel confident with that decision because misty knight is not really uh, i mean uh, at least for my veteran account um misty knight has not worked that well for me so um for this case we're just going to be selecting uh spider-man 2099 uh, I'm pretty excited because um, he has worked very very well for me especially in timeline battle um, in terms of Shadowland and uh, Alliance Battle Extreme he is really good in Shadowland and Alliance Battle Extreme he can deliver uh, not as high as Luna Snow but since we are just starting out and we're doing the free to play account he can at least get us beyond the 100,000 mark if we use him in normal alliance battle and of course alliance battle extreme given that we also have shuri to um, help her damage the t2 passive for shuri so we're gonna be sticking at this tier one um spidey 2099 uh, but that's not really bad at all it's really useful so i'm gonna get uh spidey 2099 and we have to find a way to grind uh grind bios for him probably a another premium s selector someday but um once we get her enough bias for him uh, at what miracle it's gonna be happening then he's a very good choice for t2 or a T2 Mega Rank Up Ticket. Alright, Tier 2 advance, Mega Advancement Ticket. So, let's see. Um, but right now, I'm quite happy to have him at 6 stars. So, let's claim this. Are you ready? <laughs> okay, uh, let's claim 2099. I'm quite happy for having my character now. Uh, Spider-Man 2099. But I cannot shake the feeling that I just got a an agent five star agent venom from the uh from the premium selector character no the, the premium chest okay all right so we just get uh some rewards here as well i'm gonna be claiming this off video um outside the video so because it's quite numerous so yeah uh, i think that's it um again Mar net marble has been very very generous to everyone and we really appreciate all the, the rewards you're giving out especially for new players or players with new accounts like me so things to look forward to uh let's see here the check-in rewards so things to look forward to um we still have the 7 day check in is okay now, and again, thank you for a 6 star premium character. Uh, we have 6 star selector next week, and yeah, we have at least 2 other 6 star selectors and then 1 selector tier 2 characters. Again, um, if um, you are watching this video, um, I really, really need or I really, really appreciate if you can give me some suggestions. Let me know in the comments or uh, message me because um, these are really good um, rewards that we will be receiving. And of course, um, please take into consideration that we are starting out uh, on this account. So um, when you uh, when you suggest, don't be <laughs> don't be trolling on the uh, the comment section uh, because. Uh, you might be suggesting Hulkling or something like that, which I cannot really do. And uh, Hulkling 
or uh, the other troll characters um, doesn't really help okay uh, anyway um, for the seven day check-in uh, sorry the three-year anniversary check-in is another one ah, by the way we just received our six star mega rank up ticket uh, I already claim it and it's on my inbox um, I also need some suggestion uh, probably I will use it uh, on a premium character that I already have so right now um, the premium character that I have is the following I have um, hold on. so for the bios let me see here okay so for the bios we have uh, a one star luna snow we have a one star vulture a one star moon knight and uh, a two star enchantress so i'm i want to be able to decide whether i use it the six star mega rank up uh, character uh, with either luna snow or enchantress or do we use it on an ultimate which is either anti-man blue marvel or nova i'm thinking uh we might need to save it for an ultimate uh particularly nova because he is right now a meta character and it's not really hard to get him to um tier 2 so we, we can be grinding on the on the laboratory for universal biometrics so I'm thinking to save that uh, six star mega rank up ticket for him. So let me know um, if you have any suggestion. And uh, just looking at the last few rewards here, so we're, we're gonna be we're we're gonna be expecting six star Winter Soldier, which is not to mention my most favorite character in the game. Uh, not really because he is now the meta but uh, winter soldier has always been my f my favorite character ever since they started it, it's only sad that um there isn't much love given to him uh, up until now so once he, he got his infinity war uniform everything changed so hopefully we can get winter soldier and of course the crystals uh, that will be coming in garut will also be there hulkbuster star lord and rocket raccoon along with war machine we will be uh, using our tier 2 advancement sometime in the next couple of months so let's see who will we um we're gonna do tier 2 all right um i guess that's it uh, I, again i'd like to thank you guys for sticking around and watching the video if you have any comments suggestions please feel free to let me know by a message or um, comment on the video and of course, um, thank you once again and we will see you on our next video which is uh, going to be more on how to manage your free-to-play account. Thank you guys and see you on our next video. Bye-bye.